So this is a 12mm solid steel bar. We're going to be putting a M12 thread onto that. And you see this is a pretty sharp edge at the minute. First process we're going to do is to put a bevel on there with the impact to bevel product to fit the adapter to the impact wrench. We're going to get our impact to bevel, pop that in. So we've now got a nice burr on there, ready for our threading. So this is the impact to die holder. We've got the M12 die to go in there. And then the guide collar, which has already got the M12 guide fitted. So we're going to line up the lug with the retaining hole. And that collar can now be held securely but also spin freely. So it's going to go into our into our gun. Get that lined up with some lubrication. Okay, so we've got our new M12 thread on there. Working nicely as you can see. Now with this guide, to get our thread on there straight, we can only get so close up to the end of the fastener before we um, come into the space zone of this guide collar. So what we can now do is replace that with what we call the flush collar. So we're going to line up the recess in the collar with the locating lug. Again, that can spin freely. And that's going to be when we're going to thread the rest of the section. I'm just going to point out Inside our 50mm recess inside the adapter, it's got markings so I can see I've now threaded up to 45mm depth, which is uh, the dimension. I'm going to take that up to 50 and then back out. So now cut our thread to the end there. And that's your uh, impact to die set up.